Ahoy, fellas! You wanna know what we're doing today? Um... I mean, it's all this stuff, right? Oh, no, it's this... Where the heck are we going? Wasn't there something to do up here? I could have sworn there was something to do up here. Wasn't that the whole point? Come on. You know what? I guess I have to go there first. God, that's so fun. Let's do it, pals. Yeah. My friends. Okay. Cool. So... <laughs> what was it? God. Oh, God, are you ready to hear my, um... My, uh... Oh, what am I gonna talk about today, fellas? So... Ah, God. I was gonna do a, a basic run-through of how my, uh, week has been... Because I, I, I keep, I don't know if this is just this feeling I have, but I keep encountering things that I'm like, you know what, I could talk on the channel about this, and then I completely forget about them by the time I play another episode of Yogi's Island Express, because this is really the only game in which little enough happens that I can fill space with actually talking and not have useless gameplay. You know? So... Oh, jeez. Am I flying up? Hey, you know? No, I'm actually not. There we go. So... You know what? This will shoot me on the gun. Okay. Okay, cool. There should be... Is that the head? Sort of. It is head. What, so no head? Um. <laughs> Ooh. There should be a puzzle thing down here. Probably. That, or it's only this puzzle that I've already done. That would suck, huh? Since I've already done this. Oh boy, I thought I was gonna go back the other direction. Okay, well, um. Yeah. How about that? I can't wait to have the ability to jump in this game. Because that's um, the only ability I'm lacking right now. So, I have this problem, right? Where I uh, drive. Oh, hey, that's how you do it. No, no! Oh, God, that sucks so bad. Um. <laughs> Does, does anybody else, like, constantly get cut off by by people with handicap plates? And then, once you see the handicap plates, look at them and be like, Oh, I guess it must be a mental handicap, since this person doesn't know how to drive. I can't... I'm getting cancelled for that, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> Is this so wrong, huh? Whatever. Hello again, Postmaster. I hear the Slug Gardener has more than a professional affection for the slugs. Oh, what is this? The I've run out of things to do NPC that tells me what to do next. Cool. So, yeah, that happened to me today, actually. But I mean, I I, I was in um, irregular traffic today, so apparently. And I, I always hear about this on the radio, but it never actually happens in any place that actually affects me. But, like, an 18-wheeler turned over on the highway. Um, and it wasn't one of the ones that I was actually using to get anywhere, but it was... Um, it, I want to say it was on an entrance ramp from a road onto the highway that I was on. And so, there was a lot of backup from that old debacle. And then, for whatever reason, there was just like an oil tanker stopped on the highway that I was on in, in the middle two lanes. <laughs> and so that was really fun. 
Please? Okay. Oh boy. That was almost stupid and bad. But instead it was cool and good, so... I'm happy. Where did they want me to be? You know what, it's probably at the top there. Sheesh. And how exactly I'm going to get there is a real fun question to answer, I'm sure. <sighs> well, let's just try it, huh? How about that? Oh, jeez, what the heck? I was not expecting that. Can this take me? Cool. Cool and good. So, yeah. It was a fun drive home. It was about twice as long as it needed to be. And it normally is. But, uh, I mean, it honestly wasn't that bad. And at least I didn't have to get on the, the ramp that was closed. So, I'm... Um, I mean, I'm fine on that for, in that regard, you know. This is not where I need to be, actually. Open up! Om nom nom, who's out there? Go away, I'm, uh, working! You're eating cake, and we both know it. Okay, so... I am out of ideas. You think if I talk to the guy that's in town again, tell me where he wants me? just need someone to tell me that they want me on the Sophia. <laughs> God, where can I find a woman that'll look at me the way Diane Foxington looks at walking garbage? Yep, I said it. So, yeah. I guess I'm just gonna fall down again. Oh, hey, not as far though. Oh, what the heck? There we go. Um, um, um. Where shall I go? I guess across a couple loading planes back into town, except this time they're not, well they are loading planes, but not so heavy on the loading part this time, seeing as I didn't have to load. Well, I did have to load, but I didn't have to deal with loading. Whatever. I wonder if I should, I should talk to Mokuma about, uh, anyway. go ahead and place the chunk you've got on the slab. Didn't I already do this? Oh, it completely... Okay, cool. Cool, wonderful. I had to do this again. The Obtanium Mines? Yeah, yeah. It's almost like... Did I not save the game last time? Yeah, that's probably it. Wonderful. Let's talk to Mokuma, just because. Sup, pal? Okay, fine. Maybe not. Sheesh. I'm an idiot. Okay. Back up we go, back up we go. Wait. Okay, never mind. I have to go over here to, be, to get out of the beeline anyways. But, yeah. I guess, um, being stuck in traffic isn't the funnest story in the world. But, um... I have a couple of traffic stories, sort of. It mainly involves me, either me driving fast and listening to, drum, to like, grunge rock. Because that's what I listen to, I guess, in the car. Um, that's, that's one of the weird things. It's, rock stations are divided entirely between, like, classic rock and, like, the most emo grunge, um, I'm not gonna say garbage because I don't, I don't actually dislike any of it except for the ones that are like, I'm gonna kill myself, you know? Um, oh, is this... Is this a patch of dirt? Oh, no, it's not. Well, yes it is, but whatever. Eight bottles, how you know it? Final chunk of Umbaba, the amazing, the amazing puzzle. Once again, in plain sight and just out of reach. Except, um, I already did it. Okay, now I just feel like a moron. Whatever. Wow, collection. Back we go. What a difficult puzzle. What the heck? Anyways. Final chunk. Let's head back to the tent and put it all together. You better give me the ability to jump after this, I swear. Or a bee suit. It would be nice to have a beekeeping suit. I'll take a beekeeping suit, actually, if you have one on spare. The ability to jump can wait. Um, personally speaking, um, the ability to jump would be a much nicer gift than a beekeeping suit, seeing as it is like a skill, you know, Give a man a beekeeping suit and he'll eat for a day, but teach a man to jump and he'll eat for the rest of his life. Or so they say. So, 
um, it, it would be cool. And again, it would help me in a lot of the places that I'm not sure what to do because there isn't anything nearby except for a cliff that I can't run over. But whatever. Yoink! Huzzah! We have done it! It's the ugliest looking statue you have ever seen. Oh, what the heck? Oh, Baba! You runt! You never teleported anywhere! You just hid in that statue! <laughs> But it was in pieces! Wait, hold up. He, he... He hit himself in a statue, and then crumbled it apart. I don't know about that. That seems a bit... That seems like a bit of a stretch. Maybe a little bit. Go ahead and claim your reward. Your work is done. What a bummer this proved to be. Yeah, what a bummer. I only found my freaking friend. Now I'll be able to swim fast?! That's actually great! That's... okay. This this was worth my time. Um, I, I sure hope there are parts, underwater portions of this game that I haven't already done, because if there aren't, I would be disappointed by only just now finding it. Whatever. Overdue packages are on the table. All of them have to be delivered. Oh, wow. Hey! Very cool. I did deliver all of the letters, apparently, and um, I guess on the next episode we'll have to find a bee suit so that I can finally deliver the last package, and um, from there we're going to be back to wicker man hunting, wickerling hunting. I called it wicker man on purpose, okay? Yep, and maybe even spreading spores of destruction on the island just for funsies but till then like comment and subscribe or i will cut you off in traffic and then drive five miles under the speed limit because i am mentally handicapped goodbye Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.